is the entrance to our new elective care hub. It feels like for a long time we were just working like at ground level, so there was a lot of work uh, building the foundations, putting the tiles in, ready to uh, A, build on and B, put our lovely tower frame to lift on. Um, so that took quite a long time. There's, even before that, there's a lot of surveying that needs to be done and just checking every day that the ground is still stable enough to hold such a piece. Um, and then there's been a lot of internal work, so both sides, like both the buildings either side of the electric care hub have had quite a lot of work gone on the side. So the IMRI Cougar Code has gone the first floor, adjacent to the R Block Theatres. It will have a plant room up on the top floor, and then the ground floor is going to be the potential of the A&E, the more extension more extension to the A&E and also pharmacy outpatients. So yeah, just got a little bit more steel work to do here. They've already started at the other end, um, putting flooring down, so they put like steel flooring down, they pour concrete on that, putting walls up, so that will just continue to follow it forward. Walls, roof floor, make it watertight. Sure? And then we start the interval. So we are just on the first floor now. So this is where the IMRI is going to be situated. We're on the same level and the IMRI will be put into the building. It will be craned up to a place over there. It'll be laid down, and then it's gonna to have to be physically pushed through a hole that's left in the wall to enter the IMRI suite. And that's how the, uh, that's how the IMRI will enter the building. I feel really lucky to be honest, to be able to be part of the team that are building it. It's just gonna make such a difference to the, the kids and the parents and you know, and the whole hospital. It's been a challenging pro project, but we're gonna change it and we just wanna get to the start of the realisation of that piece.